this is my latest project a complete web server based on an Arduino Uno been working with those here off and on for the last couple of years playing with them fantastic little they call them an MCU for a control unit but they're actually little um, micro computers and this particular one has like 32k of memory it's a nice little machine they uh, they're not very expensive four or five bucks uh, for the Chinese version and you can get them in the US for uh, I don't know maybe 14, 12 to 14 bucks or something. And the top layer is a internet shield for the Arduino. And that allows us to connect to the internet and build our own web server. Or we could build a client and uh, interrogate uh, other web servers all over the internet. From anywhere in the world, this little bitty sucker can be accessed. Anywhere in the world that has uh, internet connectivity. Now the uh, little thing right here on the corner that's believe it or not that's the disk drive that'll take these little SD cards a little micro SD cards in there oh I saw one the other day 200 gigabytes that's a that's more memory than we had at Mutual of Omaha when I started working in the computer division there back in back in 1964 I'm telling you the progress of this electronic stuff has been amazing during my lifetime and if it weren't, weren't for politics, I would, I'd wish that I was maybe 21 years old again so I could experience this stuff as we move into the future. But I'm on the tail end of the curve now. Like my friend Ruben says, I'm in the fourth quarter. So uh, I guess I won't be seeing a whole lot more of this. But what I have seen has been absolutely fantastic. So there you have it, folks. That's the latest project. And if you'd like to help me test it out, check it out. Why, try the web address in your browser that I've uh, plastered all over this this uh, uh, little production and also in the comments that, that are surrounding it. So give it a try. See what you think. I'll be playing with this for a while and eventually I'll start putting some real web pages up. Things like being able to dial in from anywhere and find out what the temperature and humidity is down here in my dungeon. And anything else, any other information that I'd want to grab, whether or not the garage doors are open and closed, that kind of thing, so I can keep track on what's happening when I'm when I'm out in Portland with the grandkids or out in Virginia with my my uh, number one daughter. Who knows where we'll be, but this will give us access to the house from wherever. Okay. <laughs> I just want you to notice how small that little sucker is. That's the whole work there. That's it. Runs all by itself, but as long as it's got some power, 5 volt power, and and uh, plugged into my internet switch in the back room there, that's all she needs. Okay, over and out for now. Enjoy. And thanks for helping me test her out. <laughs>